Hi, I'm Jade and I'm vlogging because that's all I can do right now. My room's a mess because I'm packing because I have to move in two weeks. I'm not happy about it. I'm also setting up, try and, trying to make an easier system for my shop, my Jaded Gym Shop. If you want to buy something for diamond painting, jadedgymshop.com. Um, I have too much stuff. And then my house house isn't going to be ready for, till March-ish, hopefully sooner, hopefully not longer. Um, so I'm going to have to share one room with my husband along with my business and my hobbies. The next few months should be fun. Ever wonder how a teacher teaches from home? Okay, ignore the mess that my room is as I show it to you. Uh, I'm packing while I'm teaching. Uh, I teach online, so those two screens is where I'm teaching. They're watching a video today, so luckily I can clean and pack while I do that. Um, I thought I'd show you guys a little bit of my collection of plastic bags. So if you order from Jaded Gem Shop, and there's ever any plastic in there. It's always recycled, second use plastic and um, otherwise eco-friendly products. And uh, I reuse boxes if I get any from Amazon or anything like that. I reuse bubble wrap and bubble wrap packaging. So if you don't like that, you don't have to shop for my shop, but uh, I wanna be as sustainable as possible. And that's why I can keep my prices low because I'm not spending a bunch of money on uh, unnecessary packing products when I get enough for free. Oh, also, change my nails. Um, but yeah, for now I'm just packing and cleaning and organizing and then um, maybe later I'll show you guys my property uh, that, cause I, I'm taking stuff to put in a storage container that's on my property. Um, a lot of packing. <laughs> Send help. Okay, uh, I'll see you in the next clip. I'm so tired. So right after class, I uh, took, packed my car and took a bunch of my stuff to my property. Um, and I'm exhausted. Uh, I was going to film a little bit of, of around my like house. The, the one that I'm renovating, not like my parents' house or my husband's parents' house. But your girl got distracted because me and my husband are uh figuring out what we need to tell the floor plan drawler upper dude um so we were just too focused on that and then i got shy and didn't want to film in front of my husband um and i definitely didn't want to film in front of his dad because his dad was there so uh i'll probably show you guys that next week or sometime soon um and then i went to Harbor Freight, got more of these containers to uh, hold my things. Um, I've bought out all of these containers in the four stores closest to me, so hopefully more come in stock soon because I still need more. And... Is that it? Oh, I have an open house tonight. Um, so while I do the open house and talk to parents about I don't even know what because I wasn't told what I'm supposed to tell them except for the fact that I'm uh, the teacher and you guys can ask whatever you guys want. Um, but I'll be putting these together, stacking them so they can look like these. So I think I have about half. I know I have like at least maybe 200. Hopefully I have at least 200 because that means I only have to buy 200 more. Um, I'm tired. So I'll talk to you guys a little bit later if there's anything to update you on. Um, but this is my life right now. I have no time to diamond paint because I'm running around everywhere. And then I have to go to Target later to get more storage bins. Oh my goodness. Because I have to get, I have to put my fabric um, in storage. You guys don't know me that well for my sewing content, but um, I have a mini sewing shop um, that I need to put in storage until our house is ready, which is not until at least March. 
Can you tell how tired I am? And I'm sad. I have to take all the decorations off my wall. I'm. That is the last thing I'm doing. Do you hear that motorcycle? Okay, uh... See you in the next update. And you're all dressed up for open house so no <laughs> parents show up. And your dog's barking. And your room's a mess because you're packing the moon. It's a... Ah. Also, why do I look like a literal fetus? I look like a baby. What teacher is gonna or parent is gonna take me seriously? Would you trust this this woman to teach your children? Overall, I rate this day like a six out of ten. I got a lot done, but I'm tired, and things are not going exactly as planned. But also, like, not horrible. So, like, five out of ten. Would sometimes recommend. Packing is hell. I hate it. Packing my craft room. Those are all just fabric. I have all of this. And these to take in the car. I'm tired. I just thought I'd show you some of the yard in my house. So behind there is my uh, grandma's house, my step grandma. Then this is the house that me and my husband and his dad and all of his friends are renovating. Um, this is bamboo that my grandpa, like, look how thick it is. It's like seven, eight feet thick from the back wall to here. I'm all nervous. I don't want my husband to hear me. Do you hear all the chickens and the roosters? But look at all this bamboo. This is Easter Island. We used to do, um, our Easter egg hunts in here. And this would be our little section of the yard. My grandpa is so cool. He attached an actual boat to his house and there's a door. So like that's an actual bedroom that my cousin used to be in. And then there's a bunch of yard back there, but there's a fence like, so this area, oh, I love the bamboo. We're gonna have to cut off a lot of it and have it grow back because just in order to work on the house. Cause it's like literally, attached baby this is our this is our driveway like my grandpa's both of them like my great grandpa and my grandpa like took cement and made like their own little cobblestone so here is the side of my house and it's it's rough in there buddy she rough so maybe a little bit later i'll show you more of the inside I don't think the address is showing, so I'm gonna show you the front of the house, but later I'll show you the inside. Big windows, I like that. But yeah, she been abandoned for about seven years. And look at my grandma's fountain, how pretty. So hopefully me and my husband can fix that. So I'm going to the front of my house so that I can show you guys. Look at how cute. Yeah, there's no address. Okay, cool. So this would be our front yard. We're gonna fix the fence. That house is part of the property too, but my uncle's friend rents that. So we'll have some uh, family friends as neighbors, which is pretty cool. My grandma planted this bush. Um, my great grandma, she is long since passed away, but cool. And then we have this porch area. It's very cool. We might have to get rid of this tree depending on what the floor planner says. So we're here early in the morning to talk to the floor planner. We have to get rid of this tree. She dead. Oh my fucking gosh, she fucking dead. That tree's dead, that tree's dead, and that tree's dead. So we're gonna have to get rid of like five or six trees, which is sad, but I mean, they're dead. So it's not like we could revive them. Don't look at my husband, <laughs> he's shy. And then there's my park spot. But yeah, so that tree's gotta go. But yeah, isn't the property so pretty? There's like three houses on the property. So this front one will be mine. Well, I guess it's mine, but like we we obviously can't live in there yet. Each messed up. Here here's a little taste of how Yeah. She she needs some milk. She needs some milk. Okay. Um, I'll probably talk to you guys later after we talk to the floor planner and 
after <laughs> we need to clean up some of the plants too because nobody's really living here right now even in the back house like my grandma visits pretty seldomly so look at an, a little home oasis it's so pretty so pretty okay so uh i'm back from talking to the floor planner so we have a timeline now of like for sure what's a possibility and everything also my husband's room has horrible lighting so also i'm laying with a dog right there and then a dog between my legs she loves me so um just to update so far the floor planner talked to us and is going to try and get things approved by the city and then um pretty much the plan is like if everything goes splendidly perfectly well the soonest that we will be moving into our house is around july not as soon as i had hoped but it is what it is my friends and then um the latest would be like october of next year which i don't think it will be but i mean you never know um but either way we will be in our home by next christmas so i'm gonna probably continue living with my parents and with my husband part of the time so i just have to figure out where i want to like work from um because i got kids to teach and then i have my small business and my husband room is not does not have the space for my small business so I'm probably gonna still stay with my parents half the time and stay with my husband half the time not ideal but gotta do what we gotta do but let me know what you guys thought of the property oh and um uh right now twig all morning um the a lot of you had asked for the image of the cat the passed away cat so I'm gonna put that up right here Oh my fucking gosh, she fucking did. Um, but it is what it is. And uh, she's been there for a while. As you can tell, like all of her skin and fur and everything has gone away. So, um, but yeah, so the floor planner is hopeful um, that we can do what we want to do to renovate. And hopefully everything goes well. The biggest obstacle now is money. So, fingers crossed when we apply for a loan we get enough and that I can make money I just want my house done already like if we had all the money up front we could probably be in a lot sooner maybe by April or May so my, my birthday but money is not does not grow on trees even though we have a lot there does not and um I think that's it for the vlog. Let me know what you guys thought of a vlog. I don't know if I'm good at vlogging because uh, it's just random clips of when I remember to grab the camera and such. But um, that's it for the first one. Week one. Okay, um, I don't know whether my next video will be a vlog, a live stream, a short, anything. I don't know. The next uh, month and a half of anything on my channel is going to be pretty chaotic because I'm dealing with renovating, moving for my parents' house and also halfway moving to my husband's house and then my small business. It's a whole lot. Um, but it's going to be good. So send positive vibes, positive energies and say hello to my little dog uh and that one too oh you can only see your ear anyways um thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye